Welcome to a video from the digitallifestyle.com New Windows 10 build to look at. This is build 18865 for Windows Insiders on the fast ring using the skip ahead option. So this is a 20H1 build. As you can see we've got the watermark down here at the bottom. 20H1 builds are scheduled for next year, first half of next year, hence the name. So we're going to see this development complete probably this time next year. Microsoft are doing that because of a number of changes under the hood that they want to work on and they want more lead time for it. So that doesn't mean to say at the moment we're seeing a lot of new features. In fact, we're not seeing any new features at all. Um, so this looks just like the, the 19H1 builds that are rolling out currently. There are some fixes though. A lot are around Narrator, so they fix a lot of things in Narrator. But some of the things like cursor issues have been uh, fixed. they fixed an issue where... Um, if you had, say, Task Manager open and the Wi-Fi tab, you're on the, the Wi-Fi tab, let's say like that, um, it would remember that. So um, if I was on here and I went to 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 Wi-Fi and then next time we restarted, it would come back to that. But uh, there was a bug that was taking it back to somewhere else, like the CPU view. They fixed an issue with uh, BitLocker prompts, um, where it was prompting you to enter your BitLocker key after a restart. And that's really all the main changes. There are still some known issues, and these will be familiar if you're on the 19H1 development. There's still an issue with anti-cheat software that will cause a green screen of death. So it, you're actually blocked from installing this build if you've got that. Realtek SD card readers are not functioning properly. And there are still some issues around Creative X5 sound cards. They are some updated drivers from um, Creative for the X5 sound card, so you need to check and make sure you've got those for it to work. But that's it, that's the change of this build. So I like to do these builds as a, a documenting all the builds, um, but I also like to store off new features and I can't show you anything new at the moment, but hopefully that'll start coming soon. 19H1 is almost done, maybe we'll start getting some new features in this soon. Anyway, you can see more on the YouTube channel on the digitallifestyle.com at iStixon. If you want to ask me any build questions, fire them over and uh, I'll talk about them on the next build video. Thanks for watching this video.